Why is the cell been getting the jet ski in? It's not a job that he likes very much because then he's wet the rest of the day, wet and sticky. But the jet ski is testing floating. Testing one, two, three, testing one, two, three. This is sound recording on external speaker. The washing machine is enjoying himself, looking for a gap. He's got the speed and the agility to take basically any gap. It's a little. Couldn't see if that was was right in his face, but that was a nice spray there. Turning sideways, Ease is getting in front of them, running parallel to the back brake. And he's through. Big one standing up on his shoulder, but he's ahead of it. Happy hunting, enjoy the day. Five star floating, 660 butt cat with two 100 four stroke Yamaha's on the back. Pretty large crew this morning. Barrett is going to use up many experience points this morning here. Yeah? Last one looks a little bit fugly. He's turning southeast. Yes, he's going to make it quite comfortably. Well done, Barrent. Happy hunting. Enjoy the day. You can see the next one being pushed. Eight thirty carry cat floating nicely. Two hundred on outbounds. Pushing through over the sandbank, right through the back brake. The brakes on the sandbank. 
No, there is the back brake. It was the mid brake that brake in the sandbank. Look how far the back line is today. Ooh. Happy hunting, enjoy the day. And I pressed the photo button and not the bloody report button. Sorry, Leon, but uh, Leon is in the wash zone. In the washing machine, not the wash, in the washing machine. He's going to work his way north. Go! Nine meter butt cat come to its full right there. Leon has got some experience points that he can use today. But experience points is like uh, gaming points. You run out of them eventually. You can't rely too much of them. Beautiful launch, Leon. Happy hunting. Enjoy the day. I can just say from the bottom of my heart, thank you for showing us that you anyone it's possible to bring back a boat from the 80s with two two-stroke motors and make it serviceable and keep it maintained unfortunately two strokes want to work and Donny works his boat regularly and that's why he can come here and survive incidents like he did he knows his boat Equipment is well maintained, there's just no hiccups. And that's a push. The ice craft is working together today, it's not all over the show, there's not a big lip to get down. Nico on trim and tilt. 285 two stroke Yamaha on the back of an 18 foot some change ice craft. Very well maintained. Apparently the boat is very well known amongst a uh, Sodwana fisherman. Especially on the bull fishing side. That was before Donny bought it. And he's on the power, he saw his gap, he's gonna use the speed of the ice craft. Look at the cutting through that white foam is <laughs> it didn't even lift its nose, it didn't even shook its head. Beautiful launch, Donnie. Don't let anybody tell you bullshit. You are the epiphany of extreme boating, my friend. Well done. Thank you for sharing your experiences with us on the channel. Happy hunting. Enjoy the day. Ocean Commotion, 9 meter carry cat, 200 V6s. Wiseman has to enter him very casually because he has to turn his head around that was too soft wise when he's still on the sand he says that um, Stewart must just push a little bit he will float the tide is coming out through this channel although it's pushing in there's a side watch from south to north helping Ocean commotion getting off the bank into the channel. Pretty much deep enough, Stewart, you mm. can trim down. Yeah. Stewart and Wiseman talk boat. They don't talk English to each other, they talk boat to each other. The perfect turn into the gully wise man Stuart has to move very thin channel narrow channel out of the gully that's deep enough for the carry cat to run that is where all the big waves is and in the meantime the sidewash is taking him to the other side of the gully. 
she has to maneuver the boat in the reverse to keep it standing still at one in one place. You can see the mid brake here in the gully is picking up that 9 meter, 3.5, 3 plus ton something vessel like that. That's a big one. They dissipate very quickly, they break suddenly and then they dissipate quickly. It's another big one, Stuart, that one's got me nervous. And that's nice over Stewart. That's a nice push through the boat break there. Happy hunting, enjoy the day. Afternoon launch and return video. Haha! <laughs> We're on the air. Wind is blowing, Mons from Asterix is launching. With that very heavy fluke. The monster is doing safety briefings there on the vessel. Um, the wind is moderately uncomfortable northwesterly, more northeasterly than westerly. Weissman is creeping Asterix closer to the water's edge, getting over the lip over the hill, over whatever you want to call that. Asterix is floating. That was a nice soft push. 21 foot V cat coming up the channel. Gully is about right in front of us. It's an ugly back break breaking right onto the sandbank and the mid break through the gully is also not very nice. That guy has got no idea what ride he's in for, he's still got a cell phone in the hand. I suggest you hold on, put down the cell phone and focus. Thinks it's about to turn ugly. Ah, Moss has got God's roller coaster under control today. What a smooth, easy launch. He used quite a bit of experience points up there. Happy hunting, enjoy the day. It's the big goal coming back, ocean commotion. Smooth sailing. Getting ready for final approach. And Stuart is turning homeward. Everybody's got their seats. I would have come directly west, then up the channel, beach on 45, on, so that it's easy for the tractor to pull you out. Now you're going to be 90 degrees on the uphill.
Oh well. See what bringing ocean commotion onto speed. Gonna have some editing to do, yeah. I love how this boat glides over the water. Ah, say Stewart, you beach short on the uphill. Enjoy it. And Crosscut on the final approach. He's bringing it from far. Hey, that ice craft runs nightly. Guys, you don't, uh, you, you don't know how the wind is blowing at the moment and you can't believe it's running so smoothly. Look at that boat. Holding it back on the back of that foamy. It's beautiful. Bringing it up to speed onto the beach. That's a short beach. That's why Wiseman is there. Crosscut is in trouble. Don is a thinker on his feet, Wiseman is, is there, it's hooked. You can take it, Wiseman. That's it. Well done. Wiseman is making sure cross cutters on flat ground to load easy on with the easy loader. 